Good morning, everyone. We are from Group 17, and our presentation is about alternatives for disposable plastic water bottles. It can't be said exactly when plastic water bottles started getting into everyone's hand, walking or driving. They started to be the world's number one beverage holder, since almost every beverage came with a plastic bottle. It was also claimed that bottled water was healthy for hair and for skin and that it was safer than tap water, causing the sales to increase to billions. This huge increase in sales put, a, put plastic water bottles in everyone's hand, leading to many large-scale pollution issues, since many people started throwing them away after use. It is true that plastic is recyclable, but in practice, only a fifth is recycled. This may be since it is really expensive to recycle, or even because it is easier to just throw it away than putting it in the respective bin. The four over fifth that is not recycled lead to landfill slides, causing many pollution incidents, even deaths of birds due to choking. Ocean pollution leading to deaths of marine life, destroying our beautiful ocean and vast pollution of beaches all over the world. Due to these massive disadvantages and more, me and my team strongly believe that alternatives for plastic water bottles must be implied all over the world as soon as possible. Now I invite Tikshna to speak more about this topic. Thank you, Tim. The ingredients used for plastic water bottle production are shown here. The most important raw material is PET, which has the highest percentage in here, which is 64%. In the second position, there is HDP with 33.2%. And then polypropylene, LDP, and PVC are used as well. Plastic water bottles have a lot of properties, which has led to higher usage, although they are environmental friendly. It has a higher strength to weight ratio and is lightweight. It is surprisingly 100% recyclable. As plastic bottles aren't weld, no leakage can occur as well. These have a good thermal insulation, so heat transfer is negligible. Shutterproof is the best property when compared to glass water bottles, which has led to higher usage of plastic water bottles than glass water bottles. These are UV resistant, which makes it easier to use in sunny days as well. Some other properties which are mentioned here are transparent, acid proof, low moisture absorption, and low thermal expansion. In the plastic water bottle production, there are mainly three steps as shown in the diagram. Firstly, the pellets are heated up, leading the pellets to melt. Melted liquid is then injected into tube-shaped molds called parasol, which produces plastic paper. In here, plastic fumes and gases such as carbon dioxide and NO2 are released. Then the preforms are heated up to a malleable steel. Steel rods are inserted into parasol for bottle blowing which is mainly blowing of highly pressured air into preforms, so they expand into the shape of a bottle. In here, carbon dioxide and NO2 are released as well. The bottle made is cooled, cooled quickly to avoid creep and then removed. Then the bottles go through quality inspection to check whether it has high standard quality and then capping, labeling, and packaging happen. For all these processes, well heat, and electricity are required, and cold water is required only in the third step. Over to you, John. Thank you, Tikshana. We daily use plastic water bottles when we are outdoors or indoors. Maybe in school, universities, sporting complexes, etc. We use plastic water bottles as packaging for mineral water, soft drinks, alcoholic beverages, and agrochemicals, etc. We can use recycled plastic water bottles made from PET. We can recreate those recycled plastic to new plastic water bottles, sweaters, carpeting, etc. There are three types of problems for each stage, economical, social, and environment. In these processes of the production, we have the certain number of drawbacks to our environment. For an example, in the extraction process, Toxic waste gases are released, which cause to air pollution. In the plastic bottle production, there is high water footprint because it takes three times the amount of water for single bottle production than the amount of water we fill inside. 
as well as in the disposable of plastic water bottles. There is an increase in landfill sites and it's expensive to construct a recycling station or factory. Now I invite Rhythm to talk about the alternatives available for plastic water bottles. Thank you, Janita. There are three major alternatives that can be used for maximum sustainability. Number one, paper water bottles. These bottles are made using renewable raw materials like straw, bamboo, and husks. The manufacturing of paper water bottles releases very less amounts of toxic substances and carbon dioxide. The best thing about these bottles is that they are easily recyclable, biodegradable, and compostable under normal conditions, which will result in the reduction of landfill sites. Paper water bottles does not leach any toxic chemicals to drinking water and they are 100% BPA free. Number two, glass water bottles. Manufacturing process of glass reduces the use of non-renewable raw materials. Sand, soda ash, and limestone are used. One of the key reasons people use glass is due to its non-leaching property, making it completely safe to drink from. Unlike plastic water bottles, glass can be used for extended periods of time, given that they are very easy to clean. Glass water bottles are dimensionally stable and also easy to recycle. Number three, stainless steel water bottles. The most useful property about these bottles is their recyclability. Stainless steel water bottles can be recycled an infinite number of times and still maintain their quality up to 100%. These bottles are 100% BPA free and has no chemical substances present. Similar to glass water bottles, these bottles have high reusability and durability as well. What makes them different is their excellent insulating properties and low weight. Other possible alternatives available are silicon, wooden, paper, and bioplastic water bottles. Next, to discuss about the most suitable alternative for plastic water bottles, I now hand over the presentation to Shinash. Thank you, Rhythm. As you can see, we have considered and chosen the best alternative as paper water bottles. There are many reasons why we have chosen this alternative to be the best. A couple of them are the raw materials used for production are 100% recyclable and waste or toxic substances given out are at a minimum level. And they are biodegraded more quickly, unlike plastic water bottles. The inner resin layer can be separated from the outer layer, so it is easily recyclable. When it comes to glass, they are heavy and harder to be recycled than paper water bottles, so it increases the cost of recycling. Paper water bottles are highly decomposable than other types of water bottles, so it will never contribute to environmental pollution. And also, manufacturers are currently working on other methods to make the paper water bottles almost completely compostable. Lightweight is also another property of paper water bottles which favors in usability where you can carry or ship. Paper water bottles are more cost effective, which gives the user another opportunity to save their money for a more sustainable product. Always, the paper water bottles are 100% BPA free, so there is no harm for humans at all. When referred to sustainability, we can say that paper water bottles are the best alternative to plastic water bottles. So, next, I invite Janita to conclude our presentation. Thank you. Thank you, Shainash. Due to the problems we face because of these pollutants, it is a crucial task to replace the plastic water bottles with an alternative. The alternative we should go for should be eco-friendly and should be made by renewable resources. So the paper water bottles we chose are green with these conditions. Now I thank Ms. Shiromi Karunaratna for teaching us the theories of sustainability and our instructor Ms. Janani Kahayana for guiding us throughout this project. Keeping this in mind as future engineers, we should make this world a better place for our future generations. Thank you.